Hey YouTube, this is Big Hoss 762 again with another knife comparison, I guess. Uh, this is the Spyderco, I guess you call it the Tenacious line. A lot of people call it the Tenacious line because the Tenacious was the first one in the line. The rest of them are pretty much copied off of that. Um, I won't do an individual review. You can find individual reviews of all these knives. Plenty of videos doing that. I just thought I'd do show show all four of them together because I've only ever seen one other person do that. So anyway, we have first off the Spyderco Ambitious. Uh, I don't, uh, unfortunately I don't have the specs in front of me, but nice little knife. I usually don't carry knives that small, but that's a nice guy. I had to, it was on sale, I had to get it. Uh, Spyderco Persistence. This is the Spyderco Tenacious. That was the first in the series. And then here is the Resilience. That's a big one right there. That's about a four and a quarter, four and a half inch blade, I believe. Very large folding knife, but very nice. Um, depending on which one you get and where you get, these knives will run right about 30, 30 to $45. Uh, I got these from Grand Prairie Knives for Two of them were on sale, so two of them were only about 20 bucks. Uh, pretty good deal on all of them. And, you know, real high quality knives. They got all the options. You got lanyard hole, left, right hand carry, tip up, tip down. Really nice G10 scales. Great, great knives for the money. These are, I think they're very good value. And that's, you know, why I uh, had to buy them all. <laughs> so, anyway, uh, just, just for a size comparison here, I got a Leatherman Wave, roughly the same size as any other multi-tool. So, you know, there they are. And, uh, yeah, so that's the whole lineup. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.